morning everyone it's the next day um, I'm going to a place today where I can access and I'm allowed to, to actually go to it's a private place um, I won't be able to show much in the way of um, the venue or of anything like that or in what's in the bins more because it's a private place there is another one I'm going to today that's that's actually um, I can actually show uh, it's not far out of the away from the other place where I've got to be so I'll be able to show you a little bit there but not much at all um, but I will show you what I've got at each place when I'm finished um, so yeah come along for the ride and just see how I how I go for the day Hope you all enjoy. A small start for the morning. First location. Just have to put his bin out. Put it on the back. So yeah. That's our first location done. On to the next. Alright everyone. I've just finished my second location. Just giving you a bit of a a scenic video of what it, where I'm at at the moment on the river um, I'll quickly scan around this is what I've got now um, I've still got one more location to go to so yeah it's been an eventful day so far it's been good um, I'm liking what's in there at the moment I've got an extra three cans of gas I got another one but I'm not sure whether I've got a fitting for it or, or what to do with it or not but um, it's got gas in it you know she's got plenty of gas in that so yeah very eventful morning I also got out of the bins you know this is also what I got I got a knapsack weed garden sprayer a fan not sure whether it works and you know they're throwing things away like that and what's the point of throwing them away well, I can fix those if there's something wrong with them and I also got a little step fold away step 
Now the cord's getting caught in it. That'd be right. Mind my one hand action here. Okay. Yeah, she folds up. And put it underneath a, a, a bed or, or use it in a caravan. Nothing wrong with it. And they've thrown it away. It's unreal on what people are throwing away. You know, there's absolutely nothing wrong with it that I can see. So yeah, that's another that's one another item. Um, I've also got an electric jug. Just needs a bit of a clean up and probably a clean out. A bit yucky in there. Uh, probably does work, uh, but I'm not sure. So yeah, I've also got out some DVDs. Surprisingly, they all have the discs in them. No, it's ludicrous. People throw away things with discs in them. And there's no scratches on that one. So, I um, also got a 240 light, floodlight. I'll get that working. Probably just needs a bulb replacement. Cords down here. It's the Australian plug. Through there. Through there. Just about to let it fall. Sit that there. How much you're videoing, eh? Not to worry. Um, got a chair even. Camping chair. So, yeah, it's one of those things. I also got out some non-slip mats and some oranges. Non-slip mats, two of. Two of those. Lovely. Um... Yeah, the oranges, still in the bag, still in a packet. No, we're paying buddy nearly $6 a, a bag down here for these. $7 a bag. So, yeah, it's been an eventful morning. I'm Like I said, I've still got another place to go to. I'm loving where I've got all this stuff from. I'm allowed to go where to get this stuff. Um, the... the owners actually allowed me to go in get it um once a week and yeah it's very good that um i had one bloke he's been collecting for me for a while in the same place and um it's been very eventful so yeah i will continue on to the next place and I'll show you what's what I've got after that have arrived at our last location for the day very overcast day for the day too so let's see what we got for the day all right well um all right bin number one we had a couple in there I'll pick them out with the with me grabber Got another lot in here, yep, there's three in there. That bin's full. Not too bit bad or not too shabby. That one's empty. I've got this big skip bin here too. Uh -oh. that which I'm allowed to go through. It looks like it was emptied last week. So there's a couple in there. I'll jump in there and um, get them out and see how we go. Started going through the bin, um, halfway through cleaning this thing out. Uh, just time consuming, um, it's slowly adding up. I haven't emptied the other bins yet, so just gotta be vigilant on what I'm doing here. Uh, that comes back to work safety. In this place so yeah it's that one off two cans down the back down there and we'll empty the whole bin into the big one I 
Okay. Ready to put another beanie on the load. Quick when you got them like that. That's a big, big, bigger load than yesterday. Level it all out, put it all away. And we're done for the day here. So, homeward bound. And, um, yeah, we'll get to and unload it when I get home put this bin away and we'll be on our way This is the jug that I picked up today. It is working. Starting to boil. We'll see if it cuts off. Probably you, like I was just saying, just needs a good clean up. Um, inside and out, of course. The little heater, fan heater. The fan works, but no heat. So I'm going to look at um, trying to repair that and get it working. So, yeah, she, she, she's a worker. Let's see if it cuts off. Got some steam coming out. Yay. It's boiling. Sounds like it's about to cut off. Rumbling up. She cuts off. Look at that. So I'll clean that up and I'll um, put that for sale and yeah, that'd be great. Give her a good old clean up. So yeah, I'll, I'll like I said, I'll fix the heater up and yeah. Um, June's actually in the process of unloading the front of the car because I did do a bit of a um, roadside pickup on the way here too. So, yeah, it gets a bit messy in the front. <laughs> um, but, you know, this is the, the, the result of today's pickup. So, yeah, I'll, um, we'll have to get to an unload this now so I can clean it all out and be ready for tomorrow so yeah all right
any hard stuff that we get like uh, this one here yeah, like these ones here or even that one we un we pull them apart not an easy job we get it to that stage and we get to an uncrush it. We, put them, we don't put them in the bag, we put them aside in a wheelbarrow and we actually use this little little bar. Um, June sometimes goes go through on the process while we're sorting this out to actually uncrush it. Um, and it's a long process on how to do things. I even picked up a battery yesterday. You know? Yes, it's the next day. We, we should have unloaded this yesterday. Um, but, yeah. It started to rain. We, it started to rain yesterday, so we had to leave it. And that's why we're unloading it now. So, yeah, I'll, I'll um, actually find a boat that recycles the batteries. I've got a pile of batteries sitting over on the slab of concrete. different shapes and sizes of bottles. These ones are fancy. You can make them out of candle, candle, candle holder. Yeah. If you knew how to open them up, you could make probably candles in them. Because you you're going to take, the, no, you'd have to take the top off. No, you leave the top on. No, because I've seen would, some of the top on. Yeah, but you wouldn't get no oxygen in the joint. You'd have to take that down to about that neck there. You could leave the logo on. Yeah. Right because that way it's going to get oxygen inside. Flame don't burn that with no now oxygen. Now these are the real big long candles. Like they have on rom romantic dinners and that. Well, we don't do that. No, we don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> when was the 
last time we'd done that. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> been too busy doing this. <laughs> when we first got married. Oh, yeah. That sounds like 20 odd years. Almost done. I don't know whether it's opened or not. The paint are there. What, this one? Yeah. Yeah, I don't know whether the seal's been broken or not. It doesn't look like it, does it? Yeah. Yeah. No, it hasn't been broke. Oh, well, there you go. Full bottle of feather. Oh, thank you. Sorry. Wash that up. Sometimes they bring home beer. <laughs> Hell yeah, brother. <laughs> <laughs> you don't like it, but anyway, <laughs> to yourself. Might not be. It might be just a bit of rubbish that I fix up. Because mm. some of the times you just pour in the bin and sometimes you miss it. Yeah, no, this one's been doing. Eat healthy, come around. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Clang, clang, clang. You think the guys would break?
Are you saying? Alright, that's empty. Get to wash that out now and uh, ready for the next lot. Well, I even found a couple of cable ties. Look at that. I even got a couple of ca got a cable ties. Zip tie, what is it called? Big old light I picked up too, she works. Plugged us in yesterday, she works. As a surprise everyone, what I actually pick up in a lot of stuff. Real surprising. I'm not so surprised. I surprised June. Yeah, we come home with a fifty dollar note. <laughs> that and was drain. That was just a fluke, though. That was a fluke. That was just a fluke. I was cleaning out a stormwater drain uh, where it had a whole heap of cans and glass and that sort of thing. Didn't take any notice. Like I didn't take any notice of this $50 note that I found in the stormwater drain, but um, yeah, I was cleaning the stormwater drain out one one week and took no notice because it was all full of water and that sort of thing. Next minute, I see this see this colour thing floating down in the water. Had a sec had to have a second look, and it was a $50 note. So I picked it up. That was the best day I've ever had, floating in a stormwater drain. So yeah. That was the best day I've ever had. I have had another one where I picked up five dollars flapping in the breeze walking the side of the roads. Uh, that was five dollars. Um, I've done what? Oh yeah, I've picked up uh, coins out of the bin where people throw their money away in the bin. Um, yeah, it, it's just a phenomenal what I do, do pick up. So I'm just cleaning this up at the moment. Give it a wash out so it doesn't smell, it does get a smell on now and then. Not good when you come across those little buggers. They're yuck. Bad idea with it. No strong belly for it all. The amount that I do go through. I don't think YouTube would like me showing all of that stuff, but anyway, um, I may one day, may not, I don't know, it all depends on 
how things come about. And yeah. Get rid of that. Can you just move my gloves and those bags down there, please? Thank you. Gonna take you on a little adventure. Yeah. <laughs> um, this is what I've collected so far in butane cans. It's a full cupboard full. 
You know, they, they've all got gas in them, surprisingly, <laughs> what you can pick up. You know, this one here, still got some in it. You know, there's a, there's one that's got a fib, that's full. Chock a block full. Now, people are throwing those away um, in a bin. Yeah, it's ludicrous. People are throwing cans away in a bin. Gas cans. Not the best thing to be doing. Like, I use it for cooking my toast there. Yeah, it's, it does me. Um, use the tongs for flipping me toast over. Little, little toaster. No, it, it, marvellous. Here's that moment of blowing a few up. I'll flip you around here. You might have to um, get the tool to pull the top off it. That, that should go through. It should go through the way it is, that one. Should be wearing your gloves too. I wash my hands after every time yeah, I Yeah, I know, I know. And plus I use sanitizer as well. I don't put the lids back on them. Oh, I used to. Because it's too much hassle. Yeah. For me. Oh, you can put them on after. Not you, you either. The insects are loving your jacket. Yeah. Little, little tiny, little. I probably can't see them on like camera. Like There's one there. Look at it. Especially for this part of it. Um, so if you like it. Subscribe, give us a thumbs up, and we'll see you in the next video.